What's up guys, I'm Lydia. I'm gonna do a tutorial right now for textures and how you can do your own smart material so you can use this for each model you do. That's really really good, really really simple. You can do it in a few minutes. So I'm, I'm, I already have my bake here. You can do your bake. Um, you can see some tutorials on the internet and YouTube for this. I'm not gonna teach how to bake right now, so I can do a tutorial in the future. But, and another thing, this tutorial is about to do stylized textures with generators, not hand painted. I can do another video for that in the future, but that's it. First thing we're gonna do right now is add a filler and put not a bright color and not a dark we're gonna put like a mid color like this to start and I'm gonna put the roofness on the max and I'm gonna add a filter and future I'm gonna add a baked lightning style set this filter is very very good to style set textures uh, it will take every information for lights and shadows I'm gonna put on your base color it's really really good let's go ahead you can see that's a lot of difference on the base color you see but the this filter in default settings is not that really good so we're gonna do some changes we're gonna um, do how we want you can do how you want to do this this filter how you gonna s s do the settings but i'm gonna show how i will configure this all right here in material i'm gonna put these these settings in zero i'm gonna put it in base color so we can see uh better diffuse ambient occlusion i'm gonna set like uh, 0 0.8 0 0.8 cavity cavity is really good I'm gonna set in 0 0.9 this one is not that that good but I'm gonna put some edge intensity here that's really really good and that's it for that I'm gonna open the sun sky um, the sky color, I'm gonna put like um, gray color like this because it, if we keep the blue, this will happen, and that's that's not what we want. That's that's bad. So we're gonna put gray color to be the color we want, not blue. That's right. That's right. Um, some color don't matter. You can can choose if you want to change but that's it I'm gonna bring it up a little of the intensity and in light one I'm gonna put um, a very bright color with a lot of intensity and I'm gonna put this on the top yeah that's good I'm gonna put this on the top Right. And in the second light, I'm gonna do the same, but uh, another bright color. Um, like this. Oh yeah, this 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 nice this nice. Just put it like that. Okay, that's good. Okay, it's not our base color and this is our material. You can see a lot of improvement on the texture. And right now, we're gonna add another filler because we finished with Baked Lighting Style Z. We're gonna put another layer and I'm gonna put a very dark color for that. Like this. This, this one is good. And 
Marco, I mean pick the roughness on Max, and I'm gonna add a black mask. In this black mask, black mask, I will add a generator. Um, no, I forgot. I will add a fill layer. On this fill layer, I'm gonna pick my ambient occlusion. If you bake it, your model you have the bacon occlusion. You're gonna put after after this. I'm gonna add a levels. In these levels, I'm gonna invert, and now I can can manage this how I want. You see, I'm gonna put like this. This one is good. This one is our your our shadows. How will it be the shadows? That's that, that's good. That's right. Okay. Now I'm gonna add another fill layer, and I'm gonna add. A very bright color like this. This one is is good. I'm gonna put the roughness here, and now I'm gonna add another fill layer. Oh wait! Oh, I forgot. I'm gonna add a black mask and a fill layer, and I'm gonna pick my curvature. This one, and I'm gonna add levels again. So now I will just like like this, so you can see our edges are very marked, and this this looks very very good. Let's see, all right, Let's another one. I'm gonna add another fill here. Who I will do um like. A position and gradient a gradient of the model and I'm gonna pick um, a, a gray color this add a black mask and the generator and I'm gonna put this 3D linear linear gradient so you can see the we can manage how this gradient uh, how longer will be you see so I'm gonna invert okay and I'm gonna put like this and I'm, I'm, I'm gonna choose a color for that because I can choose an, uh, 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 however color I want I'm gonna pick choosing right there I'm gonna pick a, a, I think a saturated one I don't know I'm gonna pick like this color like a brown or vine okay I think we should, it will look really cool and I'm gonna pick the opacity to 60 wait all right it's good and you can see I can manage this like this this good all right I'm gonna uh, change some things here I'm gonna Give more saturate to my model. Yeah, that's good. That's good. That looks really good. Okay. And now I'm gonna bring um, another ambient occlusion, but I'm gonna do a more a more stronger one because I have um, like a weak image occlusion and I'm gonna do right now um, most most powerful ambient occlusion and more, more darker okay I'm gonna pick a very very dark base color like this and I'm gonna put roughness on X and I'm gonna add a black mask and I'm gonna add generator and ambient occlusion I'm gonna invert Basic thing we can 
do the, the, the shadows, the light information for our model. And you see how easy is that? How easy we can do a stylus at texture. You see, that's really, really basic. We don't need too much. We don't need like a lot of generators for a simple stylus at texture. Um, of course, you can do you can do a, a very, very uh, good stylus at texture with a lot of um, a lot of generators. But I'm gonna teach for beginners beginners don't know too much about the this program so that's that's really really helpful so what we're gonna do now we're gonna add a folder and I'm gonna bring all of my materials here my my layers to my folder and I'm gonna name this like um, styles at Styles a texture, all right, and we're gonna create a smart material. Okay, we can see we have now here, and I can delete this and I can put all right. And right now, we can just just adjust the colors. Like, if I want the blue, I'm gonna put everything blue. see that's really really good we can use for anything anything we want and test the video guys follow my Twitter follow join my server and and subscribe and like the video and share for your friends to uh, show how you can do this and that's it have a good day guys and